Hey guys, what's up? In this video, I will show you Slim Bean and Raw 4.3 ROM for the Galaxy S2. So, first of all, I'm going to show you the lock screen here. So, this is the, you know, basic lock screen. Uh, you have some uh, some animation here. Uh, you can, or, uh, you can uh, slide here anywhere to unlock your phone. So, in terms of performance and smoothness, it is pretty good ROM and as you have may notice that uh, I'm running the uh, tablet UI but this is not paranoid Android or anything else like that it is a Nova launcher this ROM comes with Nova launcher as default launcher uh, you can also change you know the settings uh, it is not actually tablet UI but I think it is expanded desktop or uh, some icons customization so uh, this is normal launcher so let me just show you in the setting about phone so here we have this is slim bean and hold r3 and this is the slim version 4.3 build one official 909 and when you tap add build number you say you are developer I've already done that so Another good thing for gamers is that this ROM is compatible uh, with the Sierra Dormex kernel, which is version 9.41, and this kernel is pretty much awesome for you if you you know enjoy doing gaming on your Galaxy S2. Uh, with this kernel, you can overclock you can overclock your phone to up to 1.6 gigahertz, and also you can overclock your GPU. Uh, this kernel doesn't come with this ROM. Uh, you have to install it separately. So after the install uh, installation of this ROM, uh, this kernel, you will get the S2X apps. You can all clock your phone with this app. So uh, let me just show you here the notification bar. It is just you know same as the other AOSP ROMs. And uh, let's check out some settings. Uh, we have here general nothing new here uh, interface we have here the theme option you can also you have to you can apply two themes you can also apply CM 10.2 themes uh, you can apply uh, you can apply NOAA NOAA themes uh, at the same time and that is pretty awesome and the next thing here is uh, nothing new here we have the custom carrier label uh, you can put your name so and the other thing here is that is uh, not new every ROM that you're that you're gonna install have this option which is the uh, dark dark slim uh, like I've done a review of carbon ROM uh, carbon ROM also has this option which is dark carbon option so nothing fancy here if you turn it on you'd get uh, some dark display dark this becomes more black in settings if you turn it off and this turn you know little grayish so nothing here new um, we have here slim center uh, with slim center you can uh, uh, download uh, the ROM you can also report some bugs if you have you can donate them as you can see we, we can download the slim bin ROM we can download the G apps um so it's pretty good just like we have software update on Samsung ROM this is a OTA if you're using uh, you know previous version of slim bean you can update it to the new version using slim center so this is a you know specific feature of this ROM and the next thing I'm gonna show you here that this ROM also comes with the slim pie so if you enable this uh, slim pie here you will get pie pie control which is a pretty amazing thing pretty convenient you don't have to you know always press this button here you can slide it here and you can have your recent apps uh, you can clear it if you open it so let's just show you here let me just show you here camera um, camera is working great no problems flash is working gallery is working um, let's just try our video mode here um, video is working great you can 
record video then let me just play it here oops as you can see it is saying unfortunately gallery has stopped so it is in front of you there is some problem here there is a problem I don't know what problem but there is a problem uh, it just stopped so let's just check out Wi-Fi and I'm gonna show you here browser let's just check out here Wi-Fi Wi-Fi is on let's try out here browser So let's just open a website here. Let's open facebook.com. As you can see, the browser is working, no problems there. Uh, the gallery error was, you know, uh, occasional. It doesn't occur a lot. That was the first time it was uh, there. Uh, you can use camera and record video with no problem but I don't know why that problem was there uh, but it is stable pretty much stable and everything is working so I'll be also giving uh, two more uh, two more I think no uh, three more three more ROM uh, reviews more uh, three more ROM reviews I will be doing and uh, stay tuned for that and this video if this video helps you out then give it a thumbs up and I'll see you in my next video peace out